welcome back friends in this part of the tutorial we will discuss with you how to locate the uh, ho uh, hole uh, on the main solid so we are given here a triangular hole whose axis is coinciding with the axis of the solid uh, is located uh, centrally uh, and, and with the, the faces two of the faces equally inclined and towards the observer so this is the uh, hole located its uh, axis is located through the centroid so we will move on we will move this uh, triangular hole over the main solid where it should be located so we we'll choose the base point for movement at the uh, intersection of uh, the medians which is the centroid then move it on to the required location so it is here and now we don't need the median so we delete them and also we note that this is when it is a hole it will also trim away the it will also trim off the slant edges of the main solid so they are removed they are trimmed like this so this is the effect on the top view this uh, triangular hole will have a significantly complex uh, effect on the uh, front view so for that different points we need to transfer one by one so we will start with a point on OA it's not edge so that is uh, OA dash O dash A dash in the front view so to get that get the point on OA so we draw the line from the required point on OA to O dash A dash that is the vertical line so using ortho command we can do it and we locate the desired point at the o dash a dash so now this construction line is no longer needed we remove it similar way next uh, slant edge is or next uh, desired uh, important point is on ob or o dash b dash but we note that OB and O dash B dash they are uh, vertically aligned the front view and the top view of OB is vertically aligned so we cannot uh, transfer this point uh, directly uh, as we did for OA and o, da o, o dash A dash so what we need to do is uh, we draw a line parallel to the base in the top view so using the offset command so we draw the baseline itself passing it through the required point on OB in the top view so like this so we transfer this point OB onto OA so now to locate its uh, height in the front view so we first transfer it on O dash A dash and then we transfer it onto O dash B dash. So the next point on O dash B dash is marked like this. These construction lines are also no not needed. So we delete them. Next is the point on O C but we note here that O C and OA the point required point is exactly uh, symmetric exactly similar way this point is located so that uh, the point on O dash A dash O dash C dash can be simply located simply mirrored mirrored so this point is simply mirrored about OB and we get its location. So also note that for locating OB, so this construction line was also not needed. We removed that. So we have now the points on OA, OB, and OC already located. The next point in the counterclockwise direction is uh, this particular point on the corner. Just note that this point is not on any of the edge, but on the slant face OCD so to get that we make a 
we can imaginary slant edge passing through this point we extend it up to the base okay so we get this slant edge in the front view also note that it is on OCD so we get this into the front view also like this now on this uh, so imaginary slant edge so this point will be like how to get that just observe so we transfer it to standard means so by the ortho command so we get the vertical line so point at the intersection we mark this sorry point lines so we remove them now this is the point which is on the back side we can change because it is uh, invisible it is uh, hidden so we change it to red color so just to we also note that similar point will be there even on OAD to that point also we locate the mirror command so this thing is to be mirrored around OD and we get that point. So in this uh, we note that we have located all points but the point on OD. So how to get that point on OD? So that will be similar to the point we locate the way we located the point on OB. So what we do we offset and uh, two option the base edge we use and uh, we must pass it through this. Uh, to get the point on OA we, we have transferred the point from OD to OA so that it will become visible in the front view so uh, we extend line up to mm, this uh, new parallel line to the base edge and we get the height onto OA first and then we transfer it on to OD. How do we transfer it? So from here we transfer it like this. So we get the point on OD this and we now remove the construction lines like this and we bring the slant edge way also to the required position back again sorry trim using this as the cutting edge we have so these are all the points which we have so i will uh, demonstrate how to locate the profile now uh, in the next part of the tutorial and also how to transfer the profile on to the development so those portions will be discussed in the uh, next part of the tutorial so 